The Google Earth environment allows us to modify certain settings in order to fit our individual needs. In this activity, what I'd like to do is I'd like to show you how to take and change the units of measure and also the elevation exaggeration. Now, in order to make this a little bit more obvious, I'm going to fly into Mount Kilimanjaro, which is in Africa. I'm just going to do a search up here in the search panel. Uh, under the fly to tab and you notice it very quickly it takes me right to Kilimanjaro here in Tanzania. Now I don't want my labels to, to show up here so I'm going to turn that search off and then what you'll notice is that we're sitting right on top of Mount Kilimanjaro. Now I want you to notice a couple things. Down here as I hover over Mount Kilimanjaro down in the bottom here I have an elevation set up and an eye altitude set up and so those are both measures that are in uh, American standard units which is feet and miles and as I zoom in a little bit closer to Kilimanjaro here what you notice is that, that those uh, units change now I want to take and I want to turn the earth over so I can look at it look at Mount Kilimanjaro as if I'm standing on the ground so I'm going to click and hold my shift I'm going to hold my shift key and then click my left mouse button and then I'm just going to take and I'm going to turn the earth on its side here and I've got a pretty good shot right there of Mount Kilimanjaro. Again, you notice that my units are in feet and this one has now turned to feet as well. Now let's say I want to take and make that mountain look bigger to exaggerate it a little bit. In order to do that, I'm going to go to the Tools and Options menu and if you watched any of the other videos, we went through some of these other tabs already. In this case, we're going to work with the 3D View tab. The first thing I want to do is I want to change my elevation units from feet and miles to a metric measure, which is, which is miller, meters, and the other is kilometers. So I'm going to take and change that. And then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take and change my elevation exaggeration. If I go from 1 to 2, basically what I'm doing is I'm telling Google Earth to double the elevation of all parts of the surface of the Earth. So what should happen now is when we go back to Mount Kilimanjaro, when we hit OK, Kilimanjaro should actually be extruded out at twice what it was before we've, we've done this. So if I click OK, what you'll notice now is that Mount Kilimanjaro has been taken in and exaggerated twice what its actual size is by simply changing the elevation exaggeration. And you also notice that my units of measure down here are in meters and kilometers.